a little too far away from me to uh, respond to comments. So hopefully, just know <laughs> here and I love y'all. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Let's have a big uh, Corin Plusa welcome for our Daphne Parker Powell. <laughs> Yay! Hi, y'all. This is Mike Kloss. This is my partner. And at some point or another, you're probably going to see a little orange creamsicle cat jump into the screen because he's very curious about Zoom meetings. His name is Morgan. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're broadcasting from New Orleans, Louisiana, and you're going to hear a lot of fireworks and stuff going on outside. We're pretty close to downtown where we are, um, but we're going to actually kick it off with a jazz standard uh, in honor of our of our place of home. All right. Could turn the bass up. Oh, up. Oh. Well, he's excited. No one ever tells him to turn up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, we're going to do. Uh, I released an album back in October called The Starter Way um, and toured around the country with it and just got home, uh, gosh, in November. 
uh, from that. And there's a, a few really lovely songs from that record that I would like to share with you guys tonight. This first one, it's called The Little Prince, and it is written based on the novella, the short novella of the, uh, the same title. And it's written from the point of view of the Fox character and that sort of idea that you are forever responsible for that which you have tamed. So this is, uh, this is a little prince. It's very different to go back and read that book as an adult uh, because a lot of us read it when we were like between six and nine years old and we really don't understand it at that point. Mm -hmm. Hopefully we don't understand it at that point because you haven't experienced loss or tragedy to that degree. But it's a really powerful uh, story as an adult when you've been through some things and you've experienced loss and, and heartache. It's, it's a real adventure to <laughs> as a grown up. <laughs> Uh, so here's another one from the new record. This is called Sentimental Pessimism. Uh, this is part one of two. Uh, and it's, uh, <laughs> it's again, uh, it's, it's a little bit of a hilarious hot take on dating when you turn 40, because you have no idea how the world works anymore, and now you <laughs> have to figure it all out from scratch. Uh, uh, sentimental Pessimism. <laughs> Thank you. 
And I have no right to kiss you like this. And it's just the universe taking a Maybe every mile is a blessing, and the blessings have always been easy for me to receive. Leave it to me to present myself with my freedom. Leave it to me to train demons kicking and screaming to the gates of heaven and expect to be blessed. Do you think uh, you could look on your Zoom screen and make sure your original sound is on? I can try. I thought I said that before I started going here. Oh, when are you, you having troubles hearing oh. it? Okay. Oh, you're probably okay then. Well, okay. well it's, it's, it turns off every time you leave a meeting, but if you turned it on when you joined, you should be good. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, of course. All right. Well, we've got one more song for you guys. Uh, again, this is going to be from that brand new record. Uh, and it is called Rip the Weight. And it's about those kind of friends that show up for you uh, when you need it the most, but expect it the least. Uh, this is uh, written about a friend of mine who invited me to share Christmas with his family and his friends uh, the very first year that I knew that I was going to be along for. Uh, it's a very magical time um, to realize that friends will show up for you in, in the most strange and unexpected places and that it is worth sticking it out for. Cover up your broken face 
What was meant to be feels like a punchline and a holy tweet. And I say, Celebration. We really appreciate you. This is beautiful. Thank you. Do you want to do another one? Or? <laughs> well, that was all we got ready for y'all. <laughs> yeah, no, we had like three cancellations. Today, oh, no. I'm so sorry. That yeah. stinks. Aww. Well, I hope everybody has a, a beautiful uh, new year and uh, hopefully we'll be able to all collaborate again in the coming year. Absolutely. Happy New Year. Awesome. Take care. Bye-bye.